And federal court defense attorneys called character witnesses to defend labor leader John Doherty and city council member Bobby Heenan. Both are facing charges of bribery and corruption. Eyewitness News reporter Howard Monroe joins us now to explain what some of the most prominent witnesses had to say. Howard, good evening. Good evening to you. You, can, you know, both of the defense teams are trying to paint both Doherty and Heenan as people who were simply taking care of their union members. And once again, that 2016 Verizon Files public hearing was sent in center stage. It's an unacceptable reason, so for the record. The prosecution of Bobby Heenan and John Dockery's corruption trial is arguing this hearing during the CWA Verizon strike was a veiled shakedown. Heenan chaired the 2016 city council hearing. It was called while workers were in the middle of a strike that lasted for seven weeks. It halted work on Philadelphia Fios's build out that was already months behind schedule. On the stand Wednesday was Edward Mooney, an executive with the CWA. He testified during that city council hearing and was asked in if the hearing was used to pressure Verizon executives during their labor dispute. Mooney said his job is to make sure the workers are taken care of. The prosecution has been arguing throughout the trial that Doherty, as the union business manager, directed Councilman Heenan through paid employment with the union to win city contracts. And another character witness that took the stand today was State Representative Michael Driscoll. He said that he and Heenan were partners in bringing as many resources as possible back to the residents of Philadelphia. Live in Center City, Howard Monroe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Howard, thank you.